Hi everybody, hope you've had a really good summer holiday and usually we'd be starting back Kangas and Roos in the church hall today, uh, the second week of September, but sadly we still can't meet together, but we want to keep in contact with you and we want to um, keep hearing from you and have you hear from us too. So we are going to carry on with videos every week on a Tuesday until we're actually able to meet again in the church hall and actually run Kangas and Roos. Now, maybe you can see behind me in the window, you can see some nice blue sky reflecting. It's a lovely day here today and uh, I thought I'd do the video from outside in the garden. Um, I'm hoping it's not going to be too noisy. Uh, I'm just going to do one song with you today and then we'll do our prayers and then next week we will do some stories. If you'd like to put some messages underneath this video today and let me know what your children's favourite stories are, that would be lovely. I'd love to be able to share those with you and any favourite songs as well, uh, just so we can really keep that contact going over these next few weeks. So the song that I've chosen today is definitely one of our favourites at Kangas and Roos and it's Old MacDonald Had a Farm and I've got some friends with me today. So I've got a duck here, so we're going to use him in our song and a pig as well and we've even got a frog and the frog makes a nice croaking noise. Can you hear that? It makes a good noise doesn't it? And we've got a dog and we've got a horse and the horse makes a noise as well. Let's hear what the horse can do. There we go. So we've got some friends to help us with our song today and I'll hold them up and then you can make the noises with me as we sing the song. So are we ready? Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a duck, E-I-E-I-O, with a quack quack here and a quack quack there, here a quack, there a quack, everywhere a quack quack, Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a pig, E-I-E-I-O, with an oink oink here and an oink oink there, here an oink, there an oink, everywhere an oink oink, Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a frog, E-I-E-I-O, with a ribbit ribbit here and a ribbit ribbit there, here a ribbit, there a ribbit, everywhere a ribbit, ribbit. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a dog, E-I-E-I-O. With a woof woof here and a woof woof there. Here a woof, there a woof, everywhere a woof woof. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a horse, E-I-E-I-O, with a nay-nay here and a nay-nay there, here a nay, there a nay, everywhere a nay-nay, old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Well done everybody. I'm not sure what the neighbours made of that, but never mind, we won't worry about it. But I hope you enjoyed that anyway. So let's say our prayer for today. And then we'll say bye-bye and we'll see, I'll see you again next week for another uh, short video on a Tuesday lunchtime. And God bless you all and I hope you're all doing really, really well. I know some of you have started to go to preschool and uh, that's really exciting and I hope that's gone really well. And maybe older brothers and sisters have gone back to school and that's a good thing too, isn't it? So we're praying for you, for um, good, happy times and protection over you and your families. So let's pray now. Let's do our one, two, three, four, five. Thank you, God, that I'm alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Thank you for our friends. Amen. Are you ready? Get your fingers ready. One, two, three, four, five. Thank you, God, that I'm alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Thank you for our friends. Amen. And when I'm driving in my car or walking down the street, thank you, God, for being with me and bless the ones I meet. Our hands together, we must do, and as we bow our heads to you, we close our eyes and softly say, thank you God for a lovely day. 
Now I love that prayer that we say together, but actually there's just one thing I want to say about that because it says our hands together we must do and actually when we're praying it is good to put hands together sometimes and to do that but we don't have to do that when we pray we can pray and talk to God wherever we are whatever we're doing so we don't always have to put our hands together and close our eyes but sometimes it just helps us to concentrate but we can pray anytime anywhere whatever we're doing playing on the swings jumping on the trampoline reading a book uh, eating our food anything so that's a really good reminder for us all anyway that's goodbye for today and i hope you have a really good week everybody and i'll see you again next tuesday bye